Cincinnati man is arraigned on charges accused of setting an apartment on fire in Westwood and doing it on purpose. Fire officials say that they had to rescue at least six people from that burning building. Mike Shell joins us now live from Westwood with the dramatic communication between first responders as they made those rescues. Yeah, Megan, here in the 3300 block of McHenry Avenue, just off of Westwood Northern Boulevard, this apartment building behind me was a scene of some very tense moments after the fire last night. Now, the Greater Cincinnati Tri-State Chapter of the American Red Cross tells me they are helping 15 people, which make up 11 different households. Fire investigators and insurance company representatives were at the apartment building on McHenry Avenue today. Neighbors pitched in to clean up the debris that the fire left behind around 6.30 Monday night. Possible one alarm reported of someone having set a building on fire. Flames are seen. Court records indicate that witnesses said they saw 47-year-old Anthony Williams at the scene with a gas can at the time. And next thing you know, we were all sitting outside. Then the guy came back with a gas can, goes upstairs, throw gasoline all around, and set the building on fire. Jeffrey Berry says he lives directly behind the apartment building. And I've seen all the ambulances and everything, and I said, what the hell's going on? And I've seen them all trying to go up high and everything like that. Man, I didn't know what was happening. McHenry Avenue between Westwood Northern Boulevard and Brokaw. Report of several people, at least three, trapped. Dispatchers sent over 12 different first responder units to the location. We have a large multifamily dwelling. Heavy smoke coming from the roof. Companies actively searching for victims as well as fighting the fire. When the first firefighters arrived, it was clear that there were people still in the building. Star 35, we have multiple people trapped. People on the back side of the building, they were hanging out windows uh, and they were trapped. So we ended up doing six rescues. Help me on the uh, Charlie side, has got three out of number 12. Anthony Williams is charged with aggravated arson. Did they catch him? Yeah. Oh, he done then. He done. What do you mean he's done? He's in trouble. A total of 98 firefighters responded to the blaze, and fire officials say that the damage to the building is estimated at $400,000. Anthony Williams is now behind bars at the Hamilton County Justice Center. He's being held on a $100,000 bond. He is scheduled to appear back in court on September the 14th. Reporting live in Westwood, Mike Shell, Fox 19.